New Contemporaries has been in existence since 1949, supporting artists through our annual open submission touring exhibition. During this time, we've established a reputation as the leading organisation supporting emerging and early career artists. We support artists at a really crucial point in their careers, just as they are leaving formal or alternative higher arts education. We do this through our development programme, which includes our annual touring exhibition, online platform, mentoring, studio bursaries, residencies, fellowships, and much more besides. I'm really delighted to be able to introduce our fantastic selectors for the 2021 iteration, internationally recognised artists Hugh Locke, Tai Shani and Michelle Williams Gamaker. During selection for this year's show, Hugh, Tai and Michelle demonstrated their incredible generosity and sensitivity to the challenging 15 plus months that those in the arts ecology have experienced through COVID-19. As a result, we are really pleased to be able to support 75 artists this year through Bloomberg New Contemporaries 2021. One of the really incredible things about this process is that you see so many work, like such a broad spectrum of, of, of making. And then there are the things that just really stay with you. You're not just backing the work, you're backing the work, yes, that's how it's supposed to be. But I'm also in, investing in the person in the artist and that that for me is important because that little seed that i saw earlier on which i thought you know what this is somebody who needs to be back because i think they're they're serious about their practice and they if they keep going they will get somewhere speaking from my own experience 20 years ago in 2001 i applied um to new contemporaries and so i guess it was a very formative moment for me in, in terms of being um, fresh out of my undergraduate and, and starting to exhibit. And I think um, seeing that process from the inside was a real honour, actually, to kind of understand that um, you're actually looking at a cross section of what's happening in art schools into you know in 2021 and I think the process of not knowing who applies but then getting to see what people care about um, and how they respond there's something really wonderful in the unique configuration of three artists looking and really making a claim for the artworks that they select even though the three of us have you know, different sensibilities and different backgrounds um, in terms of our own practices. The, there was very little, um, when it came down to it, there was very little disagreement. And I think that we all were drawn to, you know, similar works ultimately. I think that we, we there was quite a strong agreement around like works that we thought really, you know, caught our attention. Working with Ty and Hugh, um, it felt really wonderful after kind of a year of not being in conversation and close dialogue with other artists to actually say, why do we choose this work, you know, and why does it, what, what's its place in the show and uh, why, why is it relevant to this moment? It's what's happening now, you know, and that's what will, will always keep new contemporaries keen. It is contemporary, basically. It is of, it is of now. Art is not just one thing, it's many things. And that's how it should be, and that's how the selection process should operate, I feel. If you look at the new contemporaries alumni, it's so exciting to think that um, there are individuals in the show of 2021 who are going to be really known artists in the field. We have a lot more um, artist and the normal selection and I think we wanted to be generous you know in the spirit of also what a difficult year this has been particularly for young artists and and finding you know the resources the emotional and and like uh cerebral resources to make work in this moment and we wanted to find a way to to honor that a little bit and to you know to kind of um, acknowledge that I think 
was really important to us. You can engage with these artists' work, which more so than ever captures the essence of our times in engaging and diverse ways through our online platform and our exhibitions at First Sight Colchester and SLG London later in the year.